Three years ago, should be sat in a chair like this in a basement in a building that was known as the Abbey. And in that basement, he made the proclamation that he was the king of freelance. He wore that title proudly. He told everybody that was within earshot that he was the king. And then eventually he bled for freelance. And that earned him the title of the heart of freelance. And he wore that title proudly. But there's one title that Shook D hasn't worn. And that's the actual freelance championship. And every time your boy got close and put those chips on the table and bet on himself, he crapped out. He crapped out versus Isaiah Velasquez. He crapped out in a six-way scramble that saw Mustafa Ali become the champion. And now, I'm all in again. And on top of that, I made a promise. A promise that I would be freelance champion by the end of the year. And I only got one chance, and that's versus Stevie Fierce this Friday. There's been one consistent thing, though, and I'm even doing it now. And that Should D talks a lot. Should D says a lot of things. And this is the one time where if I ever had to walk it like I talk it, it's this Friday. This is bigger than losing a title match if I don't get this one. This is Shook D becoming a liar. Becoming a man who writes checks that his ass can't cash. And I can't have that. Stevie, you made it very clear. You're younger, you're better. You've taken the freelance title places that has never gone. And you think so little of me that you have other people cut your promos for you. Cool, man. Awesome. And in some ways, you're right. I'm a failure. Maybe I'm too idealistic. I dream too much. But that's not going to stop me from walking in that ring, standing across from you, and daring, defying. Casting all that doubt to the side because doubt is a liar. Because I can keep that promise. I will be freelance champion. I got no other choice but to free, be freelance champion because if I don't do this, then the heart of freelance stops beating. And I'm sorry, Stevie. You pride yourself as being a pretty man, but you ain't got the hustle or the muscle to be the heart. You don't have what it takes. You don't have it in you to be the heart of this company, but should do. This company was built for guys like me. The outcasts, the ones that they would never give a shot, the ones that they feel ain't main event material whatsoever, yet here I am. I gotta beat you, Stevie. Because this is a statement. Not just to the world, not just to how wrestling works, but to myself. That when it all counts, I can come through. Stevie? You fight for that title. I fight for my meaning. Because if I don't beat you, I ain't got a damn thing left to talk about. I'll see you this Friday. Shig D's coming with everything he's got.